am a massive fan of recycling and so I have here some gorgeous fabric it's um it's embossed it is from a secondhand shop and it actually was um, like a really thick good quality I think maybe Sheridan quilt cover in its time so I've cut it up I've laundered it and I'm going to be using this fabric for the makeover of some very affordable stools from a large discount place because even when we buy new it's totally okay to customize it's totally okay to individualize and I like to call upcycling not necessarily recycling the product so we're going to get some standard stools I'm gonna upholster the cushions reattach the bases and they're going to look completely bespoke. First things first, grab some wadding from your local supplier. Place a seat pad on top of the wadding and cut around it just with a normal pair of scissors. It really does not need to be perfect. There we go, a simple circle. The more layers of padding you add, the more comfy the cushion will be. I'm just going to be using one layer. Now time for the fabric. Place the fabric right side down, place the timber seat on top as a template and using a pencil or fabric chalk, trace around it. With a minimum of a three centimeter allowance, then cut around that pencil marked out circle. Now for the assembly. Fabric right side down first, wadding on top of that and then the timber base, making sure the screw holes are exposed and facing up towards you. It is staple time. First staple, I always do opposite to me. And then the second one at 180 degrees from that. I secure this at quarter points then. So at 12 o'clock, three o'clock, six o'clock and nine o'clock on the clock, making sure that there's plenty of tension on the fabric so that you have a really firm and tight pull across that wadding. Then simply make your way around the circle, folding small pleats by hand and stapling them in place, making sure that you keep that tension on. Cut off the extra fabric and any frayed edges. And now it's time to reassemble. Line up the holes on the frame and the timber seat and reattach the base using the original supplied screws. As simple as that. And that's it, four completely finished, completely upcycled and recycled stools. There is never ever an excuse to have plain or boring. You can have you in every single space. Thanks for tuning in. Make sure you're following me on Instagram to see my latest design and reno inspiration. You can find me at Naomi Findlay Official or click the link in my description. See you soon.